Good morning. This is my morning view. I'm just watching the clouds roll in off the tops of our little mountains. It just looks kind of neat. This is the remnants of, we always get like the tailwind and the remnants of the hurricanes that come in down south. But it mainly went south of us. We're just kind of getting some of the rain bands and all that. But this is my morning view this morning. Just watching the clouds roll in. It is right at the height that's just hitting the top of the hill. It looks neat when they do that and then they kind of wisp their way down. So this morning I am working on getting some things done in my office and I have to go finish getting ready here shortly. And I am excited because today at lunchtime I am having lunch with a marketing friend and it's I think the first time I've done a lunch since all of this COVID started and of course there's going to be masks and social distancing and all those things. Um, but I'm excited because I don't know. It's just, <laughs> I miss all of those things. Um, I'm trying to get a little bit of work done now. I've got some meetings this afternoon. So I'm just going to try to fit everything in and get everything done, all the things. And I will take you along for our day. I'm about to go change clothes and start getting ready to go to lunch. I have completely lost my camera bag that I carry my camera around in. So I'm using a pseudo camera bag. So hopefully this doesn't break in the middle of the day. The kids started school late today because of a weather, Ten. yes, a weather delay. 10, 15, I think. Penguin's all snuggly over here. Isabella doesn't have live classes today. She just has a couple specials, so she's snuggling up with Penguin and doing some reading over here. It was his idea. Yes. <laughs> we are all decorated and ready to go for Halloween. Natalie is over here getting a quick snack. So I'm just gonna get one of these little throws and toss this on. I can never remember the name of this company. I get it at Nordstrom. It's Bobbe, Babu, Babo, I don't know. And then um, I'm tossing it on some of my Tory Burt shoes, which are comfortable with some jeggings and one of my old navy tank tops. This is kind of how I've transitioned out of those spring outfits where I had all the really light kind of these lightweight kind of kimono cardigans. So I like these when it's warmer outside and then I kind of transition to these lighter ones that I get off of Nordstrom or Nordstrom Rack. And these work really well for this kind of in-between season. So this is the outfit for lunch with some jewelry on and I'm gonna head out here shortly. Sure. just made me a better and for the kids before I go and Penguin's wondering where his is. <laughs> So the whole afternoon just flew by. I got done with my lunch, which was really, really awesome. It was the first in-person lunch I think I had since like March. So it was really nice to, well, that, that like wasn't with my family, but um, it was really nice to social distance and wore a mask in and all of that good stuff. But it was a much needed time to chat and decompress and it was very, very lovely. So the rest of the afternoon I had meetings, which is obviously not fun for you guys to watch, but I had meetings and now it is the end of the day and I've got to go make dinner. So um, I'll take you along for our evening. And also I wanted to share some fun things that I found. I'm already starting to think about the holidays and decorating. And I did a Ray Dunn swap the other day. So I'll share that with you. I, um, if you have followed me during the holidays before, you know I do like a whole section of our house with like gingerbread stuff and I have a tree that I put mainly gingerbread items on. I just love gingerbread decorations. So in one of the Ray Dunn groups, it happened to be a, um, and I have the bowls that match the set actually, but there was a gingerbread house and a gingerbread like boy cookie. Um, canister that came up and I thought that it'd be really cute to decorate on the counter with those just as a seasonal item and be something fun so I got those earlier in the week on a day I wasn't vlogging so I'll share those with you but I'm already starting to think about decorating for the holidays now that Halloween is over by the time you're watching this video Halloween is this weekend for us and we'll be vlogging but um, yeah, I'm already thinking ahead. Speaking of thinking ahead, I got this collar. It's a tree collar on Amazon. And I've not really used tree collars a lot. I've used uh, the tree skirts a lot. But I got this for the little tree that I put here in my office. I'm hoping it's not too big. Um, but I don't have a lot of floor space here in my office. And I just have one of those like tall thin trees, so I thought I'd try a tree collar this year and just see what I think about it. So this is what the front of it looks like, and then it's just like a kind of metal, 
Um, so I don't know. This looks kind of bigger than I thought it was going to be, but we'll see how big it ends up being. But I'm going to stow this away for when we start decorating, but I found that on Amazon and I figured after the whole like fall tree fiasco, because I found that tree and then by the time I went to order it, the price had doubled. So I was like, well, I'm not going to have that happen again. So I just went ahead and ordered these. So I had this for when I get ready to start decorating. So for dinner tonight, we are going to have this vegetable lasagna. This is quick and easy to make. I just have to pop it into the microwave and heat it up real quick and we are going to have dinner. These are big enough that we just end up splitting it in half and this is enough for everyone. And here are the gingerbread canisters. I thought that these were really cute. So I have bowls that match with this little gingerbread guy on there as well. I don't know if I have anything that has this gingerbread house on there, but this is cute because it says, oh snap, and the other one says gingerbread house. So I'm going to put these away for Christmas and I thought that those were excellent finds. They will go cute over here on my... Uh, little canister area so here is the lasagna and this one had the cheese plop off but it's okay i accidentally plopped it over upside down but anyhow this is dinner the veggie lasagna is good if you like lasagna and veggie lasagna penguin shake shake, shake. Hey, I oh he's coming shake. over here to shake sit shake good boy good boy you gotta say it just once isabella otherwise it 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 confuses him. Right, buddy? It, 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 it. <laughs> yes. Oh, yes, he gets pepper. So that is it for our evening. I feel like I have to kind of like retrain myself how to vlog after we get home from a long trip because you get so used to filming trip things that then you get home and you just forget to film the usual things that you film when you're around the house. But... We are settled back into our routine and I'm working on everything around the house. And this weekend is Halloween, so we'll be sharing our Halloween weekend and what we do around the house and what little bit of trick-or-treating we'll do. I think our neighborhood is doing trick-or-treating, but we're just putting sticks of candy out in the yard, like candy literally on a stick where people can just pull it off of there. And um, we're just planning on going places that'll be social distancing. So I don't really know how much candy the kids will end up with, but they don't really eat a lot of candy anyway. So it should all even out. It still be fun to dress up. Natalie is going to be Elsa and Isabella is going to be the girl from Minecraft. So they're very excited about their costumes and dressing up and all of that. Um, and I'm gonna be Minnie Mouse. I think I'm gonna use my skirt that I got um, off of Amazon and I didn't use it on this trip but I can use it to Disney bound Minnie Mouse and it'll work perfectly for Halloween because it's comfortable and I can put as many layers on as I want if it's a little bit chilly and it'll work great for Halloween. So that's my plan. I obviously have mouse ears. So um, we will be back with more vlogs and just kind of getting in the swing of things. Actually gift guides are going to start pretty soon here and I'll be sharing some gift guides coming up as well so be sure to check those out. And thanks for watching. Have a great day.